first dust some corn flour here now I roll out my fondant don't make it too thin let me show you the thickness like this first I'm using this one and I'm cutting two of them press nicely and remove excess fondant this side and remove the cutter so we remove this one I rolled my fondant again and cut this one. This one we need two and remove excess. And remove excess from here. It's very easy. This one we need only one. Good. And remove excess fondant. So we keep them aside for dry at least one day. Here is our pieces. They are completely dry. Now we are making the cut. I'm using this. Let's see. I place it here and then place this bottom part then I'm placing them like this like this okay I'm using this glue you can check the recipe how you can make this glue I will give the link in the description box. And then place it here. I'm placing this one here. Exactly like this. So it's not standing here. So I have to use some support. That's why I'm using this uh, styrofoam. If you have anything else, you can use only this one. Need these supports until they are dry. This one here and place it here. So I place it here like this to get the support. And this one also this side. And another, I take another one. I think you can watch it. I will show you. Let me place it here. And then see. You can see this one is dry. Like this. This one. So we are joining here. So I keep it aside for another one hour to dry. After one hour, they are also dry. Let me show you. This is our cot. I'm making a small balloon for the decoration. So I make it like this. And place it here. So here is our baby cut hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching see you soon bye bye